What's up guys, my name is Khan, and we're back today with more Zapekist, and today the theme is movie tracks, so see if you can guess what movie I picked to make this track. So here we have the track, and I made a relatively large cityscape track for this, not too much, but you start up on this roof, we gotta jump into this sort of area here, and then we gotta jump across and go through this area, and then we gotta jump into this area and jump up to here onto this roof, then jump across and go down through this, and each one you can see is kind of like a little bit of a swing, you know, you're kind of swinging through each each different thing. I made them out of clear glass. I was really hoping they'd be more invisible. But, you know, you're kind of swinging through the city. So that's sort of the, the theme I was going for. And for this track, I did something that a lot of people have been bugging me to do. Where I made an expert finish. So you can see here, the finish line is right here. There's no checkpoints in the entire track. And you can obviously take this jump, jump across, go to here, and then jump through here and make it to the finish. But there is also a skill shot. If you jump from this angle here, you can just see the edge of the finish. And if you can make it either through the crane or around the crane just perfectly, you could hit the finish and get a slightly quicker time than if you go the long way. So we're going to just do a run of the track right now. I'm going to do it the normal way. Um, I'm not really going to spend time trying to get the skill shot. Of course, when we actually get into the public lobby, I'll probably do it the normal way once just to put down a time and then try and do the skill shot. But you can see it's a pretty cool track. Lots of like big flowy jumps, really smooth. And of course, you're, you know, sort of swinging that jump. You actually have to make sure you take it at the right spot. None of the jumps you want to really drive off the end. Uh oh, that might be. Hopefully that's not too slow going up here. Jump of this. We're going to full hands up. Oh, uh, I think we're too slow. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, not gonna make it. Yeah, perfect. Gonna do that again. Should get it, no problem. Just turning over. I love this first jump. It's It always feels like you're gonna miss it, but it's so smooth. And then we just come off this one. Bit of an angle. Should make that. Perfect. Into this one. Just want to barely clear that. Excellent. Right like that. Flying up onto this roof. And we want to land flat. Perfect. That's good that time. No weird squirrely bits. Take this jump. Now you could right here just, you know, go for that crazy quick jump finish. Skilled shot, whatever you want to call it. But instead we're going to take the normal way. Which is just jumping to this thing and hopefully not screwing up. Perfect. And then jumping up to here. I am putting my hands up and then breaking at the same time in midair. Just to keep my car as flat as possible. Um, and it just kind of helps keep you aligned. And then here we go, jumping into there. And then final jump here. It doesn't look like you have enough, but you do. 57.9, perfect. So of course, if you get the skill shot, you skip that whole last section. But uh, pretty easy track nonetheless. I haven't actually really... Well, I tried to do the skill shot. I haven't been able to get it yet. But either way, you know, I'm thinking that in the public lobby, some people will probably get it. I'm sure by the end of it, everyone will be doing the skilled shot. But I've seen a lot of, like, you know, skilled shot tracks in track media. And we're not trying to hide anything. We're not trying to cheese people. This is literally just, you know, from this angle, you can tell. It's just that one corner of the jump. And you got to sneak it through the side of this finish if you can do it. So let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. Let me know, of course, what movie you think this is. And let's jump right into a public lobby. All right, guys, are you ready for my movie-themed track? Is yeah, it Superman? Mm -hmm. it's, did you say, is it Superman? Is it Batman? Is it Batman? Superman? It, it, might, it might be. Listen, I call the track. Man? Listen, just, just read the name of the track, okay? You'll is it get the Fantastic the, uh, Four? No, it's not Fantastic the Fantastic Trek? Four. No, it's not. Is it yeah, Cats? You guys will figure is out. It Shrek? Look at the track name. Is it Spider-Man? Swinging from webs like some <laughs> sort of spider guy, okay? That's the... Hmm. That's the oh. Okay. Oh, I oh, see. This is this is interesting. It's yeah. Catwoman. People say that I like to make a lot of jump tracks, and this is this is a lot of jumps. Oh, these transitions though. Yeah. Good luck. <laughs> this is spicy. I made this oh. one took me a long time no, to learn how to do spidey. it. No, it is spidey. It's spidey. Oh, got this. yeah, I get it. Oh, nice. <laughs> I also made a, uh, a finish that's not a cheese, it's intentional, but I made a skill shot finish. So in Track Mania, there's a lot of tracks where there's like an easy finish and a hard finish. So I, it's one finish, but you could hit it from an easy direction or a hard direction. And I've never ah. hit the hard direction once. Once you get there, you'll, you'll see what I'm talking about. No, I always no, hit okay. it from the easy okay. direction. I was like, am I supposed to land inside that crane? No way. <laughs> but uh, that is, it was correct, no way. I can't even make the first But it was correct. <laughs> no way. <laughs> oh, no, please, no. Guys, no, I don't no. think I got my, so far. Uh, my spiderweb dispenser is working. Yeah, I know, right? Keep mm. falling. 
I keep failing. Actually, it was funny. My uh, my girlfriend came into the room while I was building this track, and she's uh, well, like, right when I was validating it at the end, she's like, "Oh, that's cool." And I'm like, "Yeah, it's my Spider-Man track." And she's like, "This looks like Rainbow Road, but worse." And I was like, "That's <laughs> pretty much what all our Zapekiss tracks are now. It's just terrible versions of very difficult." He just wanted to tell us he has a girlfriend, guys. That's yeah, that was the big flex. Oh. Yeah, hundred percent. Man, those last couple jumps are rough. I mean, I mean, I'm assuming they're the last couple. I haven't gotten past them yet. <laughs> right. I hope that they're the last couple. The, the first jump is rough. <laughs> Second jump is rough. This well, actually the first one, I feel like rough. you don't want to go off the end of the first one. You want to cut it off a little bit short. You don't want to go off the end on any of I'm them, doing. by the way. Yeah. No, when I was building this track, it actually took me a long time to make it just because all the dry, like the jumps are all at weird angles and they're all like sloped weirdly yeah. and getting all that mm -hmm. perfect took a while. And no, then I cool. built all the scenery after the fact, but... Mm, that's an interesting strategy. Yeah. Ugh. Ugh. Yeah, wow. Toughy. But I tried to make it feel like you're, you know, swinging through a city, you know what I mean? Like you're just... All right, I should put down a time here. 55, that's pretty good. I don't know if I'm going to beat that. We need a cleanup on 5th Ave. Got a splatter <laughs> spot. <laughs> oh, yeah, me falling over and over. <laughs> now I'm going to go for the secret advance, not secret at all finish. So you know that tower crane, Scrapman? The, yep. the advanced finish is that if you line yourself up through the tower crane and you can jump through the tower crane, you could theoretically hit the finish line without having to do that last couple jumps. So you, oh, you can't, all right. There is a way. If you can jump through the tower crane, like literally through it. Oh, I see the finish. I didn't even notice it was yeah, all the like way it's over right, like there, right down there. But like the way the tower crane is positioned with the carrying thing too, it's almost an impossible job. I've literally never hit it. It's theoretically possible, but I've never been able to do it. You're becoming like one of those people like, man, there's a cheese. Wait, where do you but like go off it. of the tower though <laughs> to get into the finish? You gotta go through the tower, like jump through the girders Ooh. of the tower. Oh my oh, gosh. I see. Got yeah. into the tower yet. Yeah, I'm just yeah, gonna try I, to finish normally. I first. see it from a distance. I have I have yet to meet it up close and personal though. Well, it was because I keep getting a lot of comments of people saying like, "Hey, in Track Mania, you know, people do these expert finishes where it's like if you hit it a very specific way, you can get the expert finish, or there's like a basic finish that's easy to do, and they're not usually a huge difference in times, only like a second or two. But I was like, oh, I should try and do oh, an expert. I don't know if that 54.9 that might be an expert finish. Jeez. So I figured, I don't know if I did it right, but I figured I would try and do an expert finish this time where it's like, there's theoretically a finish that's... Oh, I keep landing too late on the third ramp. Yeah, yeah, same. I keep building. landing too far and I'm just not making it up the hill. Yeah, you got to barely clear like the lip of the third jump so you can make it up to the top of that building. Well, we're... We're building some hard courses lately. I was going to say, can we tone <laughs> yeah. it down next week, maybe? <laughs> yeah. Let's go I, back I and build like an easy course skill. again. Just an easy theme. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, except when we did easy theme, you also did some dumb. Everyone, wait. Well, I made a track that said easy, okay? Listen. <laughs> With a bunch of grass. <laughs> That's true. That's With true. a bunch of grass corners, bro. Come on. <laughs> Remember when we were just trying to get the best time and not just trying to finish before and the time runs out? And not just trying to, like, yeah, <laughs> yeah get past true. the first 25% of the track. <laughs> Listen, okay, it had to feel like you were you were Spider-Man, okay? That, that was the problem, and Spider-Man don't take no risks, If I risks, was Spider-Man, you know? I would be in the hospital, like, 50 right, times Listen, already. Con, with great power comes great responsibility. <laughs> that's true, that's true. And this is a very irresponsible <laughs> yeah, track. Yeah, very <laughs> I, oh, thought it, no. I thought it was a cool track. Oh, wait a minute. <laughs> oh, uh, people are trying to do the, the secret outer jump now. Did I make it? Oh, I made it. Let's go. Let's go. I finally oh, did it for the first time ever. Yay. Oh, my God. Let's go. Oh, I jumped around the tower crate and made it. It's like fractions of an inch. Like, it's so hard to hit that jump, but I did it. Let's go. Oh, it's it so good. It very hard, but... Yeah, there's a tower crane in the way. 
Yeah, well, I purposely, like, position the tower crane so there's, like, you know, there's no margin for error. Like, you have to hit the perfect line or else you're missing it. Did you go to the left or the right? I went to the left, but, like, you have to set up for it on the down ramp by cutting, like, way to the outside and then cutting across, you know what I mean? Yeah. I've literally, ne I've been, I've tried this track for, like, two hours. I was never able to get that jump. I finally got it. I was so happy. That was amazing. Oh. This is like the new cheese meta. Instead of hiding the cheese, you don't hide it. You just make it extremely difficult. Well, that's what yeah, I mean. In Trackmania, it's a legitimate, like, they do this advanced finish. I don't know. I keep getting people telling me to do, like, expert finishes, where it's, like, it's a finish that's very obvious. And it's, yeah, someone just called it out. You jump right through the crane. So there's nothing, there's nothing impossible about it. It's just, like, good luck trying to get it. I almost did it again, but I missed. I still die at the first jump. Now the rest of them are all hyper-focused. Yeah. <laughs> oh, Cosmo it got it. More. Cosmo, he didn't oh. even say anything. He just got it with a 40. Just waiting for people to notice. Bro, that was sick. Waiting for people to notice. How'd you jump? Did you jump through the crane or around it or? Around it. On the left? Yep. But I had oh my a bad goodness. time leading up to it. Oh, so. you there's gotta a 37. Be there's a 37. I got, I got through the crane and then hit the top of the finish line. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> 37.8. Wow, that's fast. I like how my second place time lasted all of 20 seconds. Yeah, right? <laughs> oh, I see. Well, people called out into chat that, oh, you just got to jump through the crane. And now I feel yeah. like everyone's trying to do that. So, but that's the point. It's not, it's not a cheese. It's not like, you know. Yeah, exactly. It's just sneaky. a hard It's just hard. I don't know, man. It felt easier to just get it over with and keep going on the track. <laughs> <laughs> that's how I felt. You're like, all I got to do is make this one really hard yeah, like, jump literally, like, or like, three why keep going? easy jumps. <laughs> well, that's, that's what I mean. Like... <laughs> Yeah. But the easy jumps just felt like way more risk. That's fair. I can't believe it literally took like a two hours. I'm not even joking. Like I'm not even exaggerating. Literally two hours of practicing that and I was never able to get it. And then I get it once and then like four other people get <laughs> it right away. <laughs> They're like, oh, easy. Yeah. <laughs> easy. <laughs> can't believe it. Someone says, I saw Khan fail. Yeah, he must have been the guy. I, I took a jump, hit the tower crane, and then someone crashed into it right after me. So I feel like it might have been him. Ooh, what the? That was a weird landing. Man, I'm not even on the freaking podium anymore. Only eight people managed to get the jump so far. Have you finished Scrapman and Dapper? No. I finished once. Yeah, I saw daps at a time. I have not finished yet. Someone's like, there's gonna be a second cheese that gets you to finish in 10 seconds. No, I didn't I didn't put any cheeses on this map. It's not even a cheese, it's a skill shot map, guys. It's a skill shot. No! Ah, oh, damn. Glad you put that fan on top of the roof. Every time I go yeah. on there, I'm like, man, I got no speed, and then the fan just magic but those are not easy jumps bro get out of here what are easy jumps? <laughs> three easy jumps he says <laughs> the end ones yeah they're pretty easy you just go straight at them it's like i i, I guess i don't know it just seems like way more effort <laughs> I hit the crane i'm in the crane oh one more try be the crane i have jumped through the crane once without dying but then i overshot the finish when i did it Oh god, I'm not gonna make it. Oh. No, there's only 29 seconds left. No, I didn't oh, even get put man, in. No, I <laughs> no way. Nice, uh, unique. Nice. Wow. Get out. Still didn't Good hit stuff. the podium. Crazy. Well, well GG. at least I made it. Hope you guys liked my Spider-Man track. That was cool. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I, uh, you know, I really wanted to try and do that that thing everyone keeps telling me to do. So I'm, I'm well, glad people figured it out. I'm a little a disappointed people figured it out so fast. But I got a time right at the end, 43. Oh, nice. nice Legit or through the crane? 
Uh, I went around the left side of the crane That's, and yeah, uh, crashed my body crane. into the finish. Nice. Well, let Good us know stuff. what you guys think in the comments down below. Give us other themes for tracks. And, uh, you know, make sure you check out the other guys' movie-themed tracks. I'll put the links in the description. And we'll see you all next time. Bye. 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 Yeah.